Today I'll teach you how to use SQL Data Reader in Windows Forms application. So let's start. So the very first thing, I'll open Solution Explorer and from there, I'll be opening the form. Now I'm adding a data grid view to the form. Let's move to the code behind. We'll start by adding some namespaces. So the very first namespace is system.collection.generic then system.data.sql client So the very first thing I have created class customer Here I'll be creating some properties. So the very first property is customer ID The second property is contact name The third property is country so here I have created a string variable and inside that I am reading the connection string. I have created an object of SQL connection class and I have passed the connection string variable to it in the constructor. Next I am creating an object of SQL command class and I am passing the SQL query to read the data from the customer table and SQL connection object to it in the constructor. Now I am creating a generic list collection of customer class object here i am making use of sql data reader to fetch the records from the database table the sql data reader is generated from execute reader function of the command class the sql data reader is created inside the using clause so that it is disposed automatically after the task is done the records of the database table is read inside the while loop which will run until the read function of the SQL data reader returns a record inside the while loop the data is wrapped in a customer model class object and inserted into the generic list collection created earlier and finally we will assign generic list collection to the data grid view data source so that data grid view can be populated so with this we complete our programming part and now it's time to run our project and see it in action as you can see, the data grid view is now populated using SQL Data Reader. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to click the bell icon. Goodbye.